Hello everyone. Today I'll teach you how to draw the respiratory system of our body in the simplest method possible. So let's start by drawing an L shape which should be curved in the corner. Now this is the chin. You're drawing the face. Now use a pencil and extend the top portion of the line. Next I'm drawing the nose. Draw a straight line as I'm drawing. Next draw two straight lines for the neck side by side. Next draw two horizontal lines. It may not be straight. You can just draw it freely. Now we are going to draw the head in this shape. Go upwards a little bit and curve all the way. You can stop here. Now we need to draw like this. So you can mark a point. See? And we need to draw a curved line touching that mark. And join. Okay? Okay. Next, we'll rub off this little line here. Next, we'll draw the shoulders. Like this. And the next shoulder. Okay. Now we need to draw two lines here. That is the wind pipe. You need not use a scale, you can just draw freely. should be a little more longer next we're going to draw another two lines from these two points you can mark these two points if you want and just draw two straight lines One like this and like this. Next you need to curve the line and draw as I'm drawing. Continue drawing. You are drawing the lungs. Now curve it and join it all the way to this point. And similarly the other side. Curve it and there you go. The same way like this. We have drawn the two lungs of our body. 
Now we are going to draw the connection of the windpipe. Draw two lines like this connecting to the lungs. And complete it like this. Next, we need to draw a curved line to the nose. The windpipe starts from the nose, so I am drawing a curved line like this, connecting the second straight line. And this is the mouth and from the mouth we need to connect it to the first line. So we have completed drawing the respiratory system. Next let's color this diagram. Here I am using brush pens which are of pastel colors. I am choosing pink and a skin color see we'll use the pink to color the lungs and the windpipe you can also use color pencils or crayons so let's color the lungs first I'm just coloring it all the way and now I am giving a second layer towards the edges that is going to give it a nice 3D look. The same goes for the second one. There you go. Now I'm just giving a stroke towards the edges of the body. Keeping it simple. Next, let's color the windpipe. Here I am using the same pink color. You can also use slight red color. But make sure the outlines are visible when you color it. Okay, now you have done with the coloring. Next, let's label the parts. You can use a scale and mark. We are going to label it as lungs. You can use a pencil and draw a horizontal line. So that your diagram looks neat when you write it. L U N G S lungs. And finally, we need to label the windpipe.
W I N D P I P E. So that's it. Hope you like this drawing. And if you liked it, please share it to your friends. Thanks for watching and subscribe. Bye.